Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. The Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam narrates in a hadith from Sahih al-Bukhari. When the month of Ramadan starts, the gates of the heaven are opened and the gates of hell are closed and the devils are chained. This hadith explains a lot to us about the importance and greatness of the month of Ramadan. We can infer from the opening of the gates of heavens to mean that God makes our journey to the heavenly state of utmost peace and happiness effortless and accessible under His divine grace in the month of Ramadan. During this month, believers have a month-long opportunity to change their lifestyle and environment to attain a higher state of self-consciousness. Such, such a journey would help them enjoy every moment of the month and qualify for an uninterrupted mercy and blessings of the divine in this life and the hereafter. Closing the gates of heavens means that Allah is eager and ready to forgive every sin committed by anyone if sincere repentance is wanted. The month invites us to self-evaluation and identifying weaknesses in character, following by actions to better ourselves. In other words, forgiveness is the greatest offering for this month. However, one must realize that repentance and forgiveness has to be done in a manner that is genuine. It means that a person person is conscious of wrong actions and is willing to change the lifestyle and never repeat it to the best of their ability. But if a person does not have the intention to change, it doesn't work this way. Chaining the devils means that God makes it easier in this month for people to control their behavior and their desires, both physical, social, and spiritual. In a moment of high self-consciousness, an individual would ensure that he or she does not commit any act that would either defy the divine or reject his mercy. Thus, this month provides opportunities to earn great rewards and substantial forgiveness. The more intense a person becomes in seeking these goals, the more beneficial the month becomes to him or her. We should all strive to be the best version of ourselves and be eager to change for the better. And the month of Ramadan is a great place to begin doing these things. Subhanakallahumma wa bihamdika shadu wa la ilaha illa ant wa astaghfiruka wa natubu ilayk. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.